the makeup tutorial using a full face of Bare Minerals. I am so excited to be collaborating with them to bring you this look today because they are one of my favourite makeup brands. So the look is going to be this navy and gold smoky eye using all cruelty free, high quality, high performance products. And this is inspired by the Bare Minerals Give the Stars Christmas range this year. I just love the packaging of these products. The navy and gold I've tried to recreate as closely as possible but I'm going to talk to you a little bit more about these in the video. Without further ado, let's get started. First things first, I need to put the old cat ears on. When I have my cat ears on, that means I am in business. I'm going to start by prepping my base with a moisturiser. It's the Complexion Rescue Defence. I'm just going to apply a couple of pumps of this to my face. I love this because it has SPF 30 which you should wear every day in my opinion. It feels really beautiful on the skin as well and it gives me a gorgeous like radiant base for popping foundation on top of. Now I know in my last Bare Minerals makeup tutorial I used the original foundation which is still my absolute fave. So many of you were really impressed in my last video with how well this covered blemishes and just gave a really beautiful natural glowy base but I want something a little bit heavier today because it is Christmas party season so I've chosen to be using the Bare Minerals Bare Pro Performance Wear Liquid Foundation. I've chosen this firstly because it's 24 hour long wear like lasting performance just what you want for party season you don't want your makeup slipping off your face but secondly it's a matte finish and full coverage which is definitely going to be amazing for all these blemishes that I've got around my chin and kind of below a half of my face at the moment. This part of my face is suffering and I want to cover that all up. I'm just going to put a couple of pumps of Fair 01 on the back of my hand. I also quite like to custom blend this foundation so I'm also going to be adding a pump of Dawn 02 just to darken it up a tiny bit and I'm going to be taking the Lux Performance brush and just start working that into my skin starting from the inside out and you can already see it gives great coverage. Even though this is a liquid foundation it still contains minerals, so it isn't going to clog your pores, which is always something I'm quite wary about, especially being kind of acne prone. It's also free of oils, parabens, sulfates, and fragrance as well, so it's kind of free from all that gross stuff that you don't want to be putting on your skin and full of just really nice clean ingredients which is something that I really love with Bare Minerals. Next I'm going to start working on the eyes before I finish my base. So for the brows I'm going to be using my Brow Master Sculpting Pencil. I'm just going to use the spoolie on one end just to brush my brows through. They are a bit wild and unruly at the moment. I'm in desperate need of getting them threaded and I'm going to fill them in with the pencil on the other end just with some light strokes. The shape of this brow pencil makes it perfect for drawing individual like hairs on so your brows are going to look super natural. Next it's time for eye primer. I'm going to be using Bare Minerals Gen Nude eye primer in the shade Bright AF. Eye primers are definitely something I couldn't live without in a makeup routine. I am prone to quite oily eyelids and well, not only does this stop that happening, it gives such a nice base for the eyeshadow to stick onto. Also it makes the eyeshadows a little bit more kind of intense and vibrant as well which I love. My eyelids are so sensitive like I get eczema a lot on them when I use certain eye primers but this one doesn't irritate my eyes at all or the skin around it. Now it's time for eyeshadow and I'm going to be using the Aurora Light eyeshadow palette. This is actually one of their Christmas gift sets this year. Their whole Christmas gift guide theme is Give the Stars. The kind of message behind this whole gift range is that when we look up at the stars we're reminded that we're part of something a lot bigger in the universe and that all stars leave lasting impact just as we do on each other. So the thought of giving each other a star is just such a lovely idea. They've also created gift sets inspired by specific horoscopes. So every horoscope has a gift set attached to it, which I also absolutely love. I'm really into my horoscopes at the moment. My star sign is a Leo, and so the gift set for that in this Give the Stars range is the Celestial Magic set, which includes eight mini Gen Nude lipsticks, which I think is such a good idea, like literally. This is me down to a T. I'm all about the lipsticks and these are all gorgeous. So I'm going to be using one of these shades to complete the look today. But yeah, what am I, what am I, I've gone off on a complete tangent here. What I'm trying to say is I'm going to be using this eyeshadow palette, which is the Aurora Lights palette from the Gift the Stars Christmas range. And oh, 
it contains 18 beautiful eyeshadow shades a real nice mix of shimmers and mattes so there's going to be something for everyone so I'm going to be taking a lot of the golds and the browns and then some of these gorgeous darker jewel tones as well to create a nice smoky eye I'm going to start by taking the shade 500 thread cowan and just put that all over my eyelid it's quite a similar color to the eye primer but I just want a powder base on there as well and then I'm taking the shade wavelength which is a nice brown taupey shade and I'm just going to build that up in the crease of my eye taking the blender brush as well just buffing that into the crease I'm then going to take some of the shade Santorini which is a nice kind of like champagne truffle shade shimmer and I'm going to place that on the eyelid but first just going to take a tiny bit more of that eye primer so the colour really pops so just placing that where I want the new shade to go and just making a nice white base for it. I'm also taking the shade Presto which is a nice shimmer and placing that on the inner corner. And then on the outer corners I'm going to add the shade Meteor Shower which is a gorgeous stunning navy blue. Also going to take that darker blue shade underneath my lower lash line as well to build up the smokiness and before I tidy all of this up I'm going to go ahead and apply eyeliner I'm using one of my favorites it's the lash domination this has the most precise little nib so you can get really close to the lash line I'm going to apply some mascara now using the Lashtopia. This is the mega volume mineral based mascara. There's a little trick you can do where you kind of just stroke your lashes up and then as you get to the end just hold them in place and give the brush a little spin and you'll get mega volume. I don't know if you can see that but it's amazing. the eyes I'm just going to use some highlighter underneath my brow bone and in the middle I'm going to take the shade spotlight for that. I'm just going to tie the whole look together and highlight my look at I mean look at that highlight oh my god love it Now I need to clean the rest of this face up, so I'm going to be taking the Bare Minerals Bare Skin Complete Coverage Serum Concealer. I'm just going to pop that underneath my eyes, down my nose, and on any blemishes. Just blending this out with the Max Coverage Concealer Brush. Time for some contour. I'm going to be using the Bare Minerals Invisible Bronze. I'm going to take the Seamless Shaping and Finishing Brush, just buff that down my cheekbones. Also underneath my face, <laughs> my chin, just gives a bit more definition to your face, which is what you want on a night out. It's a bit around the forehead. For highlighter, I'm going to be using the Bare Pro Glow Highlighter. Oh, I love this so much. I showed this in my last video and I've been using it pretty much every single day since. It's like a liquid highlight. You just pop some on the back of your hand and use your ring finger to tap it into the skin. And it, they come in loads of different shades, so there will be something for everyone. If you do want to swatch them, pop into your nearest Bare Mineral store just to give it a go. But look, it's just so natural. And it sits really nicely on both powder and liquid foundations, which I really like. I'm also going to pop that on to my nose. And just because I want this look to be extra glam and highlighty, I'm going to be taking the Jewel Finish Blush and Contour and adding a little bit of the Invisible Glow Highlighter as well, which is like a marbleized highlight. It's so stunning. Just placing that on top. I'm going to take the Gen Nude Blush in Bellini Brunch, love this colour, it's a really pretty like peachy pink, taking the other side of this duo brush, just building up very gently. And now, finally, flips! 
So I'm having a real hard time choosing what one to use because they're all so beautiful. My choices so far, I've narrowed it down to Crave, which is a gorgeous like mauvey pink. Also the shade Notorious, which is actually, I think a very good contender. Too many choices, I wanna wear them all. Or Nudist, which is a nice peachy pink as well. I think we need something quite like muted because the eyes are so heavy. So I think I'm gonna go for this one, Nudist. <laughs> Oh yeah, I love this. I might add a tiny bit of Notorious as well, just on the outer corners, make a bit more of an ombre about it. It is Christmas after all. Take my cat ears off. And this is the finished look. I'm absolutely obsessed with Bare Minerals. They've definitely become one of my favorite makeup brands over the past year. I think not only are their products really great for your skin, including great ingredients, but they're also not compromising on quality or performance. As you can see, everything performs really well. Everything's got great coverage, great pigment. It's all buildable and it's all good for your skin. Also, I love the fact that all products from Bare Minerals are cruelty free. 68% of them are all vegan as well, which I think is amazing. I would love for you guys to tell me what horoscope you are in the comments and see what your Bare Minerals gift set is. I think they're a really great way to give presents this year. If you guys like the look of any of these products, do go into your nearest Bare Minerals store, get tested, get shade matched. I hope you have a lovely Christmas festive season. If you do recreate this look at home, let me know, send me a picture, and I will see you next week. Mwah!